An affordable plane ticket these days is tough enough. Finding a comfortable seat, nearly impossible. Well, that is unless you know our tech guy's <laughs> secret. Craig Agronoff and Herb Tabin joining us live tonight with how you should be using the internet to make sure your next trip is a lot more comfortable. All right, guys, so not every airline seat is equal. Some give you less leg room, some give you more. How can you pick the best seat? Suzanne, have you ever gone on a plane, looked at your ticket number, and realized you're in row 35, and as you take that long walk of shame, you come to the realization you're in the last row next to the toilet, yeah. and your seat, well, it's not going to recline. Yes, I've been there multiple times, actually. Then we've got the site for you, Seat Guru. Yeah, SeatGuru.com is a great way to find the best or worst seat on any flight. They make it really easy to use, and what you do is you, when you go to the site, they show you the best seat in green or the worst seat in red on the map of the site. So there are a lot of planes out there, guys. So is this really cumbersome to try and figure out which plane that you need to look onto? No, you just pick out your flight and your flight information and they'll pull the map up of the plane immediately and to the right is a legend and it'll show you which seat is the best seat or the worst seat, uh, moderate seat, but uh, it's very easy to use. It's 100% it's free and get this, they actually have 100 different airlines and they have 700 different kind of planes in their database. I didn't even know that there were 700 different kind of planes personally, but you can find the seating chart for anything. And Herb, I actually always thought the best seat was the one next to me. Well, I guess uh, we have to look and see where I had a button on the legend that says next to Craig. Well, so get back how do they me. decide what's the best? Just the most leg room or what, what, are, what are their parameters? Less likely to die. <laughs> <laughs> well, this, on the planes, there's different spots on the plane that they determine are better seats. Maybe over the wing is more stable or in the back of the plane is, is, is they say, is louder. But the thing about that is, is they want to find out which seats most of the time have the most leg room and which ones do recline and which ones don't recline. All right, you're taking care of us on the plane, but what about off the plane? Is there anything that can help you once you've landed and you're inside the airport during a layover? Uh, I like Gate Guru. Which is actually GateGuru app. Dot com and it's an iPhone application. And GateGuru Guru is, is really simple to use and what it does, it tells you what's the best restaurant, what's the best stores in the airport. Oh, so whether they have, have Chick-fil-A in there. If they have Chick-fil-A in there, of course. <laughs> now all of the reviews and the photos, they're, they're user generated so it's people like you and I, well maybe not her, but <laughs> you know, people like us who actually care about that stuff and then you're able to find you know, the best restaurant to eat at, where the best spot to sit and have Wi-Fi, you know, coffee or whatever you want to do really, you can find on this app. It's a real time saver. So have you guys actually used this? Is this making your traveling experience better? It is, and I almost feel like all the people that are in the back row are suckers now as I'm walking by <laughs> because I know I've used this and I see that row 10 is usually the best and uh, give me a little more you're arm saying, room here. You're seeing Roby in the back and calling him yeah. a sucker. Well, <laughs> well, Herb is the one that's laughing on all of us because he's on his private jet. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> all, right, all right, Craig Agronoff, Herb Tabin, thank you so much for joining us tonight.